Good old Oxbean Belsev here, eh? Susie, I told her that my wife has a Kia. Hey, little Kiki -ki Kia. And she, I wanted to put some headlights in it because the headlights she has in them are just dull and they suck. So, good old Susie from the Oxbeam store there on Amazon, go look them up. I'll put the link below. Sent me a pair of F16 H4 headlights for her. Friggin' right she did. LED headlight balls, boys. Friggin' right. So we'll open up and see what's in the box, Will. Friggin' right, Will. We got stickers. Friggin' right we do. More stickers, boys. Friggin' right. Why wouldn't we? We got the warranty card and all the goodies and the manual and all this kind of stuff and that and this and the other thing, which we need. Friggin' right we do. Why wouldn't we? Hey. So anyways, these are pretty friggin' sick looking lights, boys. Hey, check out them things, boys. Holy, they come with their own little power supply doodad, whatnot. They plug in the factory, slip in the hole, give them a twist job, and there you go, eh? They're all made of aluminum. Hey, aluminum heat cooling on them. Friggin' right. It's got a little screw-off doorknob on here for some reason. I'm not too sure what that's for. I have to look at the instructions for that. But there's the balls, boys. Not much to them, hey? Looks pretty simple to do, it does. Friggin' right. Look at that. Those are friggin' sweet looking, eh? They're decent. Input voltage, 12 to 24 volts, boys. Friggin' right. F16 series. Go look them up there, and if you want to get brighter headlights on your car, you just order a pair of them right off the old Amazon store. Look for Oxbeam. Hey, why wouldn't you? That's all that comes in the box, boys. And we'll hook them up there. And then Mama will say, I can see again, eh? When I drive that Kia at night, it sucks. Friggin' right it does. Because I'm used to, you know, close encounters of the third guy in there being brighter than dicks. Hey, why wouldn't I be? So anyways, she'll be all happy there when I throw them in. I'm not going to tell her. I'm just going to do it, eh? And I'll say, how's the headlights, honey? Can you see better now at night? See what she says. We'll see what happens, Susie. See if Mama notices, eh? Friggin' right we will. Mine are the uh, H4 9, 903s, eh? So the 903s and the HB2s are high beam, low beam. Friggin' right they are. So you can get bi-color, eh? Hey? You can get bi-color, H7s, H7s, PX, 2060s, H11s, bi-color, H11s, H8s, H8s, H13s, H13s, all color, the dark, hey, look at them all. Boys, there's a light for everything there is. The ones I got are $73.99. To your door. Friggin' right they are. But anyways, yeah. Wanted to show you them there, and I'll show you when I get them hooked up, and we'll see what the difference is in the little brightness on it. Friggin' right we will. I think it should be pretty decent. That's what I'm thinking. And uh, if anybody needs anything, like I said, links below for these ones. And uh, go look them up on the old Amazon there, because the prices are de e e -sub. Friggin' right they are. I gotta hook them up, boys. Okay, boys and girls, we're gonna go outside and hook up the headlights in Mom's Kia we are. Friggin' right we are from good old Oxbeam, eh? The F-16s H4s, boys. But it's cold as frig out. So I'm gonna run out. I'm gonna get the headlight and bring one in. We'll change one, and then we'll uh, check out the differences, and then we'll change the other one. Friggin' right I will. Can't believe I'm doing this today, boys. It's friggin' nasty out there. So I'm thinking what we're gonna need is a 10 mil, a pick tool, and a screwdriver. I'm just guessing. So let's take a walk out and see what's what. Friggin' right in this horrible, snowy friggin' right it is. Actually, it's not too cold out. It's just snowy as frig. Oh, I should have brought up the broom so I could sweep mom's car off. How am I gonna get to the headlights, boys? Hey, eh? it's covered in snow. For frig's sakes. I'm gonna get the mop, we do. I hear birds. Tweet, tweet. Friggin' right, I do. Tweety, tweety, boys. Tweety, tweety. <sighs> Where am I getting this ambition from? All right, let's go. Anything for you, Susie, eh? I'll hook headlights up in the snowstorm. Why wouldn't I? Friggin' right I would, eh? Well, it's not really a snowstorm. We're like a snore flurry. But we'll get her done. Friggin' right we will. Decent. Can't open the hood up when you got snow on the friggin' car. Oh, lost my band-aid, boys. Holy, got quite a bit of snow last night we did. Friggin' right we did. I'm the kind of guy that I like snow off the roof and everything, boys. No snowy anywhere. Frig no. Decent you watching this. Friggin' right we are. Alright. So, we need to open the car we are. Decent. Hood. Decent. Lift o hood o. Decent. I wonder if I can get to him without taking him out. I doubt it. Nope. So, first thing we're gonna have to do is remove all these screws, boys. Hey? They gotta come out, they do. Friggin' right, they do. So, let's stick a screwdriver in there and we'll give her a little doodad. Doodad. This is where I think you need the pick tool, boys, because they're all plastic, eh? They're just garbage, they are. Everything's plastic anymore, boys. Friggin' right, it is. So, we'll just get them started, because you can't push down on them or they'll just strip. There's only like 30 of them. Why wouldn't there be? So, there we go. Set that up there. We'll get the pick tool out. 
Now, if that work, I'd use my panel popper tool, which would make it a lot easier, but hey, it is what it is, boys. A little picky picky, a little pulley pulley. Bob your uncle, boys. I hear kitty kitty. I hear Mew Mew. Hi, Mew. Wanna go inside? No doubt. I'll take you inside one sec. Set that there for a minute so we can put the clips where I'm not gonna lose them. Oh, we got one that's holding good, boys. Hands are already getting numb there. Friggin' right there. I pulled the old key in the garage, but boys, I don't wanna move everything and I'll have all snow melting and I'll lose all my heat. Cause I had the heater on all night last night in case I wanted to do something. Why wouldn't I? One more, boys. There we go. So those are off. So this will just lift off at will and we'll set that there. There's a little pinny ma bobber down here you gotta pull up. Friggin' right, there's one, right? There's one. Another one over here. There's two. Hands are getting numb, boys. Only in Canada, boys. 10 mil? Oh, I was right. It is a 10 mil. Freaking decent. There's that. Like I said, I'm gonna change one at a time here, so we'll get these out first. And hopefully don't break nothing because it's too damn cold out. Now they should come out, boys. Should. There we go. A little bit of force to her. Unplug this plug, and we'll go inside with this headlight and see what's what. Come on, Mew. Come on. Kitty, 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 kitty. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Holy freak, boys. Burr, eh? Burr. Can you let Mew Mew in the front door, please? Okay, boys, we got her inside. We do. Freaking right, we do. So now we just gotta let the hands warm up a little bit here. And we gotta pull this off. Oh, boys. Like so. Hey, eh? like so. Then we gotta pull the plug out. Oh, that hit a lot. Oh, boys. Like so. And there's a the headlight, boys. So now we get one of the ox beamers. Freaking right, we will. Pull it out of the box. And she goes in here, boys. Like so. Oh, it's even marked to which way it goes, eh? So that's decent. So it goes in like that. And then we'll slide this down here like this. Because this is a locking pin. So just pull this out like this. There it is. Bring this down like this. And hooky hooky. So there's one in. So this thing here, gotta plug into this, it does. Like that. And that's it, boys. So now what I want to know is, can we put the cap back on? Uh-oh, boys. So looking at this right now, unfortunately, I don't think we'll be able to use this. There's no way that is going to go into there. Oh, okay, wait a minute. It went in. It went in. I really like to put the cap back on, boys. I'm the cap kind of guy. I'm keeps moisture out, eh? Because the headlight is sealed, right? So we got to get this back in, boys. We'll figure it out. We'll get her in. Don't worry. I wonder if I should plug that in and put it in first. So let's do that. So before you put the headlight bulb in, let's do this way. So pull it back out, the headlight. Like so. We'll put this, plug it in, and tuck this in here like so. Maybe, maybe. Oh, boys, we gotta get her in there, boys. Oh, there it is. So tuck that in there. Put the headlight back in like this. Put the old snap rooting ski back on like this. Decent. And then we can tuck this in here like this. Oh, boys, they made it so you can get it in. That's freaking decent. So there we go. So you can get it all in there. You just gotta play around a little bit. And uh, I would suggest definitely making sure you get this back on because, like I said, keep some moisture out of the headlight. Hey, you don't want to moisture in your headlight. Frick no. We gotta wrestle her a little bit, we do. Oh yeah, there we go, boys. There she is. Freaking right, so it's all in sealed again. So let's go back out now and throw this one in and check out the differences. Okay, here we go. Number L10, boys. Number L10 headlight, oh, hey? Freaking decent. So much easier to pull them out to do this. Freaking right it is. So, we'll plug this back in like this. Click, hey, click. We'll throw this back in here like this. Snap, a rooski. Gotta make sure you line her up right, boys. There's that side. We'll put the old pin in that's buried in snow already down there. We'll put the screw back in so we don't forget this side. No, oh, that's not it. Hold on, boys, I'm looking for the screw. I can't feel my fingers right now. Why the frig would I be able to feel my fingers? Holy. Anybody get a snowmobile? We could go for a rip today. Friggin' right we could. So we'll put that back in like this. And let's try them out. Right on. Oh, frig boys. Gotta move the stuff off the engine. We gotta start her up, we do. Oh, look at that, boys. Look at the difference. There's the LED one. There's the regular one. Friggin' right, boys. Let's try the high beams. If I can figure out how to use the high beams in this thing. There's the high beams. Oh, yeah. High beam. High beam. Friggin' right. So let's get the other one done. Come on, get out of there, you son of a bitch. Well, I can't see because my jacket's in the way. Ooh, hey. Eh? Ooh. Can't do this with gloves on. That's a damn problem. Holy crap. Wow. Holy, it's so freaking cold out there. My fingers are numb. 
and the battery's going dead in the GoPro like freaking nothing flat. All right, so the same thing as before. Woo, eh? So let's unplug it first this time. So we'll unplug it with a screwdriver, lift this up, we'll pull the ball. Oh, there's the ball, boys. Freaking right it is. Why wouldn't it be? So now we're gonna plug it in first, right? Is that what we said? Plug it in first. Hey, pluggy. Give it the old tucky. Somehow, someway. Why is this one smaller? What the hell? Well, we'll get her. There it is. Get her, boys. So then we'll put this. Actually, let's try putting this in first. Okay, put her way down in here because there's lots of room down inside the head. Like, freaking right there is. So there we go. Take the old bob in. The old McBobbin. Like so. Slap this back down like so. Where's the pick tool? Click, boys. I made that one look real easy, didn't I? Freaking right it did. So we'll slap that back on here like this. Decent. And we'll pause and get a coffee. Just so you know, boys, when you are double, when you are changing these and you unplug them, double check to make sure, because these pull off and they got a seal around them. So make sure they're pushed in, eh? Before you plug them back in. Because this one was pulled out. So we gotta make sure it's pushed in so it's sealed up. Friggin' right we do. And uh, the link at the bottom of the page is there for the old ox beam. Amazon store, good old Susie A. Supplied me with these for the old ladies. Ka -ka -ka -kia. Freaking right she did. But uh, now that my hands are a little bit more freely moving and the old GoPro's charging and the old coffee's going down and the cigarette's going down pretty good, you know, even though I might cut that out because this is a review video for Susie and I don't know if smoking's a big thing on the internet, right? So you know how it is, boys. Freaking right you do. I might leave it in there anyway, just because I'm Belsa. Why wouldn't I? Freaking very well. Anyway, let's get to her. All right, boys. So hopefully, get enough charge into this thing until we get this done. Because we're gonna run close here. So let's go back out and shove this one in. Freaking right, we will. Why wouldn't we? Why the hell wouldn't we, boys? Freaking just snowing like a beach. Just snowing like freaking rotten. Just freaking cut. Forget it. Freak sakes. So we'll plug this in like so. Eh, eh, eh. There we go. We'll slide it in here like so. We'll slide this side in first like so, because this is like giving me a hard time before. We'll slide this in like so. Sometimes you just gotta be a little rough with them, boys. Get in there, you son of a bitch. Probably doesn't help, it's cold and f dicks out here. Oh, there it goes. Decent. Slide the old pin back in down there, we will. There she goes. We'll put the screw back in. I'm breathing heavier in the hoover and heat. Why wouldn't I? And we'll 10 milli whack this sucker back in. Decent. We'll slap the old guard back on. Decent. Put the old pins back in. Just so you know, that one's the only one that's different out of all of them, boys. So just make sure you put that one back in the right spot. It's got a little bit of a different kind of a grabber, it does. That's why it's a little different kind of finish on it. In case you didn't know, hey? Just in case you didn't know. These sure go back in easier than they come out, don't they, boys? Friggin' right they do. The fingers are making her, boys. Don't forget to click on that link below if you want a pair of these for your uh, Kia, Ford, Chrysler, Dodge, Chevy, Hyundai, Kia, Volvo, Honda, Saab, BMW, whatever, boys. You get the point. Friggin' right you do. So there we go. LED by Oxbeam installed, boys. So let's check them out, make sure they're working. Friggin' right we will. There you go, boys. Mum's all LED'd up, she is. Friggin' right she is. That's gonna be a lot nicer for her driving at night. High beam, decent. As you can see on the guards pail, high beam is working. Decent, boys. So there we go. Ox beam, gold series, I call them, because they're gold, eh? Why wouldn't I? F16H4s for the old Kia Sportage, boys. So, like I said, don't forget to uh, subscribe and like, hey? Why wouldn't you? And uh, make sure you click on the link below to take yourself over and uh, pick yourself up a couple, hey? Why wouldn't you? But anyways, hopefully like this video and make sure you thumbs up, Ray. Eh? Why wouldn't you? And uh, that's what I did this morning. Why wouldn't I? And uh, thanks for watching and you know what to do for now.